What is up, my core knights? It is I, the resident, your local legend, legendary Boogie Knight. And tonight, we're here with Tormented Souls. And, uh, yeah, this is, I haven't played this game. I haven't even uh, tried to figure out anything about this. Well, I have. I know what it is. I've seen the early demo of this. And what it is, is pretty much if Silent Hill 1 and Resident Evil 1 had a baby with a PlayStation 3. So it's kind of got that, uh, that kind of graphical style, you know. Um, it's a survival horror, psychological survival horror. And um, yeah, it's about a girl who's trying to find out about her past. So uh, <laughs> that's all I know about it. And um, yeah, with that being said, uh, freaking if you like what I'm doing, you'll love the legends that I play with. Go ahead and check them out on my follows list. Welcome to Fright Nights with Boogie Night. And uh, whether you're here now or in the future, thank you for just showing up. And that being said, without further ado, it's time to Boogie and Tormented Souls Episode 1. Let's check out these options really quick. What kind of control we got? Uh, Alright, this is standard. Let's keep the sound and everything. All right, all right, all right. All right, all right, all right. Let's start this game. A letter for me? I never receive letters. Mm. Mm. John Doe, Wildbringer. <laughs> okay, Wildbringer Hospital. First of all, this is John Doe. Winter Lake, Blackwood Island, Canada. To Caroline Walker, 578 Rain Street. Campbell River, Canada. All right. Let's, uh... Ah! Oh. My head, it hurts. Uh, damaged photo of girls who appear to be, I don't know. Thank you. Girls who appear to be twins. Hmm. You just think you can abandon us here. Uh, why do these girls seem to have set that fire? Because uh, she looks quite happy in that picture. If that is a fire, was that just like photo damage? All right. Oh, I guess I had to inspect it even though I read it. Yeah. It's been two weeks since I received that letter from the Wildberger Hospital. Mm. Since then, I haven't been fine. I can't get out of my head the image of those little girls. I can't sleep. And when I am able to fall asleep, it's only to dream horrible nightmares. I need to know what's going on. What's the meaning of all of this? I'm going to the Wildberger Hospital. And, uh, and help oh my. Hopes of finding some answers about this strange photo. The answer's always hentai. I need Oh my. To know what's going on. Hentai is going on. Oh my. You must be coming. You must live it. Oh my. I like how it's been two weeks and you have the same outfit on. That was just your favorite outfit. <laughs> that 
that look? That looked like it would kill someone. Uh, oh yeah. Oh, you, you've done this before. Oh my. Nice boobies. Scopes. What did they do to me? Mm, I was connected to the respirator. Can I? Am I seeing into the next room? Oh. Whoa. Cutie, I mean, I don't know how patch can't fix, right? Oh God, what have they done to me? Who could have done such a horrible thing to me, and why? Right. William Wildberger's diary. Today is the happiest day of my life. After all, the suffering we have endured the past few years past few years, Maria, my beloved wife, has blessed me with two beautiful angels. But there is more. After all this time, she has returned to me. She looked at me with her eyes wide as if she had not seen me in years. Like she was waking up from a dream. That is not all. Something odd happened when I checked with my watch to find the exact time at which the first baby, Emma, was born. As I opened the lid, the glass cracked and the hand utterly stopped. I do not, I do not think this event has ever had some meaning or other, uh, have some meaning or other. I am not a superstitious man, but Maria insists that it is a sign. She has started using the hour as her lucky number and uses it for everything. Okay, so the first baby, Emma. Um, blah, 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 blah. Happened to my wife. Found the exact time the first baby, Emma, was born. Alright, so that's probably a clue to something. Oh, three. Oh, three. Huh. Wait, I can't. Which of his files? Is that. Can't zoom in on that? Uh, rotate. What does that say?
1971, I believe. But it doesn't have a time up there. Most birth certificates are due. Uh, no, this is Anna Wildberger up there. Pocket watch with a hedge on its crown. Alright, so this should be the time. So, what is that? Uh, 1235? Mm, 1235 till 34. Somewhere around there. size is adjustable. Let's see what else we got here. Do not let shadows embrace you. Alright. What does that mean? As soon as you got hit in the back of the head with a fucking pipe. Oh, okay. So you actually have to adjust it. Resources? Wow, that's a weird angle. Alright, you saw that. It's down here. Fuckery. Lock appears to open electronically. Alright. What a weird picture. Alright, this goes down here. Alright, well. Will we hit those steps? Why are they all wearing masks? 
Except for one guy. Why did that happen? A uh, clip of nails can be used with a nailer. According to the latest archaeological discoveries on Winter Lake Island, Island, the Tismet tribe resided on the island for more than 500 years before being discovered by European settlers. Proof of this is an ancient underground cemetery found deep inside the cavern on the island's shore dating from the 10th century. More than 286 skeletons belonging to 10-year-old children have been unearthed. So far in the underground cemetery, all the bones were buried in pairs, and experts suspect that these were twins buried together. Uh, but, uh, that sucks. Hey, welcome to the stream. The Nightmare Painted by Henry Fuseli in 1781. It depicts a woman in a deep sleep with a demonic incubus crouched over her chest. Demonic incubus. Sex demon. Male sex demon. The recreation is amazing. It almost looks like the original. I wonder if I can, uh, oh, yeah. haven't got it yet. What is this? Vending machine. It's out of order. I just hear something in the creek over here. Oh, I got a door here. I got three doors. Pharmacy service window. I can't see anything on the other side. Mm. Uh, vial of morphine. Treat minor injuries. With morphine? What the fuck? Minor injuries with morphine. You can imagine. Oh, this is a scratch. I need some morphine. Uh, the left side of a plastic card. Are you sure it's not the left side of an elastic heart? Maybe she has thick skin. It's covered in blood. God, it reeks. I don't dare lift the sheet. I feel you on that. Uh, I don't have a tape. A detailed mannequin of a human torso. So apparently this is where the heart goes. No files, nothing interesting. Uh, wait, is that the computer? It's not plugged in. I wonder if I can use this. Oh no, I gotta find both parts. I was gonna try to free up some space. I mean, not that I need to, I just want to free it up. Alright, that's locked down. And this is locked, right? Like, we have to open electronically. Look at this. Those not bullets up there. I guess not. Oh, looks like we're going down here. This one's locked electronically too, right? Yeah. Turn the power on. I guess I need a key card. Yep. This looks like some 
fuckery will ensue here. What is this? Maria Wahlberg's diary. June 6, 1963. I was terrified of what William would do when he finally saw my naked skin. But my fears were unfounded. He accepted me, even with the scars on my back, left by my father's whip. Oh, shit. <laughs> William asked me why he did it. Of course, I explained that the pain was to redeem my sins. William will never look at me, my father in the same light ever again. Hmm. Anything else? a door here. Uh, that goes downstairs. Let's hit this door first. Uh, let's go upstairs. What's this? Holy shit. That's one hell of a picture. Judith beheading. Hawthorne's painting by Caravaggio in 1602. Judith beheading. Kind of fucking. It depicts Judith beheading the Syrian general Halfrenes in the tent after charming him. The recreation of Caravaggio's work is outstanding. It almost looks like the original. I've never even heard that story before. That seems interesting. Fuck from the other side. Let's see. Ooh. The handle will budge. There's symbols above the keyhole. Hmm. Whatever it is, I don't have it. What the? Yep. Change ang angle camera. Heart attack. Heart attack. Are you trying to tell me I'm about to have a heart attack because something's going to pop out of a fucking thing? And nails. Use with the nailer. I do not have a nailer. I would like a nailer. doesn't seem much better. Ooh, hex and socket. It's missing a handle. Alright. Patient report. Dr. William Wildberger says the patient's health is extremely delicate and the transfer could worsen their condition. I would advise against transferring them to the new hospital. The patient has cardiac encephalitis Insufficiency, insufficiency, insufficiency. I'm gonna have to take it slow. Insufficiency, all right. Insuffic, in I can't say it fast. <laughs> and requires an immediate transplant. The patient passed away at 11.34 due to the cardiac arrest at the time of their death. They were holding on to a metal object with the ra with a rapid onset of rigor mortis. I had been unable to remove it from their hand. Huh. And there's a hand up here. No, don't. Uh, maybe that's the generator. Yeah, I love this area. What the? F All right. Oh whoa! Oh, he went that way, so I'm going this way. Oh. That's pleasant. It's been mutilated. What the hell's going on here? Why 
is Jesus wearing a gas mask? Surely the man in the wheelchair can't use stairs. He can't use the stairs. <laughs> that is straight out of Sound of Hell, my friend. Okay, that's it. Goose down. Yo, got the bubble goose down. What the hell is going on here? My child, you are pale. What happened to you? A person in a wheelchair with knives in his hands was chasing me. Oh, it's you. Don't you remember me? I'm the town priest. We met here in the chapel only a couple of days ago. What? What? I'm sorry. I don't remember you. I certainly don't remember coming here before. I see. Perhaps I'm mistaken. I'm old and get confused every now and again. Mm. What is going on here, Father? Where is everybody? The patients and the hospital personnel have been transferred to the new hospital in town. This old mansion has been left pretty much abandoned. Why are all the lights off? I don't like this. I feel the same. Something evil is happening here. Something wicked that hides in the shadows. Is there a way to turn on the lights? The old generator has been playing up. It happens sometimes. Go to the end of the hall and through the door that leads to the generator room. You can restore the power from there. I see. I'll do that. Wait. Take this with you. It's not, it's safe not to go much, along. but it might be useful. It's dangerous to walk around the mansion unarmed. A minute, Link. Oh man, is that you? This is a place you can't survive with just a sword in your wit. It's dangerous to go alone. Take this. Well, that's really kind of dumb that you wrinkle dick again. It's dangerous to go alone. Take this. Thank you, Father. But what are you going to do without a weapon? My child, with a Bible in my hand, God protects me. Inhaler with modified air pressure and tank to increase the power. Why do you have that? With a Bible in my hand, God protects me. But this nail gun also does a pretty good job. It's not plugged in. Uh, grab some of these. Anything? Oh, there we go. It's not plugged in. Wait. Is that for the computer? This is odd. Level 1 crowbar. Cool, cool, cool. Alright. Uh, I, the the I hall. came here looking for information about the two girls in this photograph. I see. What do you want to know about them? Anything, really. I was hoping to find some leads around here. I don't know what you're looking for, but I can tell you these girls are no longer with us. There was an incident some decades ago where they disappeared, never to be found again. That sounds terrifying. Indeed, if you want more details, you could try the mansion library. I'm sure you'll find something there. Okay. Thank you, Father. Take care. 
came here looking for him. Okay. Any I don't know what you're looking. There was an incident. That sounds. T Indeed, it I'm sure. Thank you, Father. All right. So down at the end of this hall, he said, right? What the? What? Oh yeah, that's. That seems like a fucking setup, doesn't it? Wait, do I have I don't items? Oh. Once I take the lighter off, that's it. I can't see shit. Oh wow. Can't just dual wheel? There's an issue with the electric generator. The pressure of the gas must be exact for it to ignite. The correct pressure is written on the control panel. Is this it? Uh. Hold on a second. Fuck around with it, I guess. Uh huh. Uh huh. Okay. Okay. Alright. I guess I gotta go look at the control panel. Map of the area. Did, did I get it? More basement generator room. X ray room. So, where did I come from? The, um. Yeah, there was something over there, blinking. Oh, valve handle. I must be missing a valve. It's uh three and a half. Got it. Hey, are we taking this now? Yeah. All right. So what needs a valve? It's you, isn't it? Alright, so so we're going three and a half. I I did it without doing it. <laughs> awesome. Is it oh, I'm sorry. I thought I needed three and a half. It's uh, ten. Misread the situation. Misread the room. Alright, so ten, huh? So. Yeah, no. What's up? That's too much. Too little. Uh, too much. Uh huh. Uh huh. That nah, drops it too much. Uh, 
Almost. There we go. Maybe it needs to be 11. So far, so good. Um, all right, 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 all right. She does not like the dark. <laughs> Radioactive suits are lined up on this wall. Wait a minute. Hold on. Weren't you, uh, weren't you, uh, bolted like. Like the rest of these motherfuckers. Hold on. No, 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 no. How did that unlock? I knew there was gonna be some fuckery around here at some point. You may find what you're looking for in the library. How can I find the? Li it's on the second floor of the east wing. Take the stairs in the main hall. Oh, you'll need to unlock the door in the waiting room. Thank you. Take care, Father. Okay. Mm. I do kind of want to check out this uh, door over here. Uh, 
let's see, files. Where's the map? Alright, so this generator room. Uh, this is the x ray room. This is where I came out of. Oh, this unlocks this door on the other side where I came down this hallway. Okay. So it should take me out in the hallway where that guy was. Uh, it's a giant handicap sign! Alright. Let's see what's down here. Oh. Fuck. <laughs> Uh. Alright, well, then call me a stupid ass. Then. Ah, ah! Oh, he is still alive. Alright. How much damage did that do to me? Well, caution? Uh. How do I reload this thing? Do I have to... Oh, I have to do it like that. Alright. I have to do it old school Resident Evil. Alright, where, where am I now? Oh. Visit if mine's what I know. What is oh yeah, that's right. That guy was down there. 